This gecko is fighting a snake to save its friend. Chivalrous, but how do these guys walk on walls? <laughs> so imagine you're a gecko, climbing about, scaling anything you want with your little bare hands and feet. Glass, metal, dead guy, plastic. You grab a snack, you flee an enemy, ah. and just hang upside down on the ceiling. <laughs> This is the life, but what gives? Because gecko feet aren't covered in suction cups, and they don't leave any footprints. The secret? Atoms. Zoom. Look, your toes have these ridges called lamellae. And if we go even smaller, these lamellae are blanketed in tiny hairs called setae. But we're still not small enough. Each seta splits into millions of spatula-shaped pads. Spatulae. So when you place your foot on a surface at just the right angle, the atoms in your spatulae get so close to surface atoms that they sink up. It's called van der Waals force, basically atomic Velcro. And geckos are so goaded at this, the force of all their little spatulae could hold up two humans. But with so much force, how do they release? Well, just curl up your toes and unstick. <laughs> For more free lessons, subscribe.